Ah! I can gravel. Hate you. Everyone. Tiffany Where sent me a picture of the supposed Michael Jackson. Yeah, apparently Blood's girlfriend sent him a picture of Michael Jackson. Or her with Michael Jackson. Brian, I did not expect this. I didn't either. Right. Uh, I think I know where those noises are coming from now, Brian. What do you mean? Uh, they're probably above us. Nah, I don't see anything. Watch. It's gonna be rain and zon- Mother hoving gravel. Yeah, dig straight up. I'm not digging straight up. Just heads up. Hey, maybe, maybe you guys will finally be able to see my character skin that I have. Whoa, holy. One that I chose and hopefully will look like. Okay, why the poop? Why is everything Zom reforming? Oh, zombie! The golden helmet. I knew it. It's a new one. They are coming from the ceiling. I want to go exploring. Well, then come down here and help. No, I mean like out in the wilderness exploring. Ow! Here's a knife and some bottle for your own piss. Go nuts. <laughs> Hear that blood? Start prepared for you. Better one. Trust me, your piss is nutritious. <laughs> But it's night time. Alright, here's a quick look of my uh, character skin. Yeah. Fancy. Looks like yep. poop. He looks like Steve on our screens too, folks. <laughs> Not on my screen. You know how funny it'd be in the video? It was Steve, yes. <laughs> 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 that would be great. I hate this freaking gravel. Like everywhere. It's this map looks super cool. Does anybody want to experience the miracle of a paper map? Not really, I'm good. I'm kinda, you know, in a hole. It's okay, you can get an idea of what the top side looks like nowadays. Who wants to see what the top side looks like? I do. I, uh, as well. What the f do you do that bit? <laughs> hmm. So this Area is. Area 51 what is what this is looking like. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna see what it looks like, Giga? Yeah, I'm good. Just wanna get this done. So bipolar. Yeah, I want to know. No, I don't. Yeah, I do. No. <laughs> don't blame me as who I am. I'm blaming you. Oh. I mean, yay. Brian, power mine. Power mine. Yep. Too bad this isn't Terraria. Too bad it's not Terraria. Uh, we'll play Terraria soon. Our oh, elevator. Oh, that was... oh, I still remember our first elevator, Brian. That's a fun noise, whoever's background that is. It was... It's a uh, radio. I don't know why the radio beeps like a clock, though. Man, it's a clock radio. They exist. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. I mean, I've got one in my room. They exist, it's just I doubt it's that. Brian, no they don't. You're lying. <laughs> I had it for three Ooh, years. Iron. Cake is a lie. Um, cake is always a lie. I don't like industrial cake. But it tastes so good. I hate it. I like homemade. And you homemade? have never tried Kroger's cookies. <laughs> I don't like home. I don't like industrial made. I don't like industrial made um, cake. 
cupcakes, cookies, eh, they're on my maybe list, but sometimes they're good, sometimes they suck. You suck. Like store brand cookies, blech. What about the Elmer Fudge cookies? Not oh. Elmer Fudge. <laughs> right, yeah, the, I don't even know. What about the, uh, the fudge grandma drive. cookies? Those things? Those what? Awesome. Little grandma chocolate chip cookies. Oh, those I like awesome. those. Just some of them, you know, not all of them, because I like, I like some of them, but, uh, blech. It's a dish. The magically nutritious. Breaking oh, my legs. Just comment if you Some like commercial legs, cookies. Wish somebody Say, how many views do you usually get per video, Giga? Right now, 3,000 million. Right now, you guys are probably my only viewers. And Panda. Do you tag Minecraft and all that other stuff into the video? Yes. I put it in the little tag bottom area. How many tags you got on each video? Uh, about three. It says Minecraft video game and then industrial gaming thing in my bob. Not enough! Apparently it's not enough. Not many people are watching. You, you must have 70,000. I want to have, I want to have, you know, almost 500 subscribers by summer. That's my goal. I mean, I could keep up the videos. I can. I can do that. You can. Maybe you should try uh, playthroughs of certain games. Maybe you know what I mean. I don't have a, ha I don't have a hap hog or something to record PS3 or Xbox, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. Hmm. Fuck. Well, I mean, I mean, like playthroughs of games like. Uh, People like. No, no, they do. Um, but games like, uh... Well, you can technically do an emulator for, uh... Like a Pokemon game or something. I mean, that works. I haven't played Pokemon in so long. Then you have missed out! <laughs> except for gener except for fifth generation. You haven't missed shit. It's, it, it's poop. Frickin' can or frickin' ice cream cone Pokemon now. That, yeah. pit, that shit pissed me off. It's like, why? I don't know. Eric Wagner still thinks it's great. I don't know. Third, uh, wait. I think it's like one, the first generation are like my most favorites. Mm -hmm. You know, Charmander. I grew up with fucking uh, tall graphic Charizard. That was my thing. I grew up with that shit. You had a holographic Charizard. You were the most popular kid on on, on the block. Yep. And then it got stolen about a week after. <laughs> got uh, stolen right out of your Pokemon lunchbox. <laughs> that happened to a kid in my class once. It's like this kid. Had like this full deck of Pokemon cards in his backpack. Came back from recess, the whole thing was gone. Yeah. Basic rules of the playground: you have something somebody else wants, keep it on your person. <laughs> Apparently, I figured out that I'm a I was a very aggressive, ba very aggressive kid when I was young. How's that? Okay, here's the story. All right. Story time, viewers. Hold on, let me get my story time. <coughs> Alright, here's what happened. So, I was playing with this toy truck, and, uh... I was playing with it. And this kid... Pauls, when you're a kid, and you already say you're playing with a toy truck, you know it's about to get real. Mm -hmm. Shit's about to get Hurry real. <laughs> anyway, I was playing with it, and this kid came up to me and said... Well, he didn't really say shit. He just took it. But just plain took it from my hands. And apparently, I shoved that motherfucker down the stairs. <laughs> like, just plain pushed him down the stairs and chased after him. Hmm. 
Is that why you were homeschooled? <laughs> no. This was like when I was still living in Colorado. Like a long ass time when I still had only one brother and one sister. I was like in... Don't you still only have one brother? I, yeah, I still have one brother. <laughs> <laughs> I still have one brother, but I have another sister. But yeah, anyway. So, my mom, my mom comes up to pick me up. She's, she asked me, why did you, why'd you push the kid down the stairs? The, one, the only thing I could say was, stole my toy truck. It's the only thing. I got hurt a lot as a kid. I still do. <laughs> Oh no, I got hurt worse. What do you mean? Well, about every other day of the week I would go home because I was bleeding. From? Injuries. You and your fragile self. Playground, me and the kids would get aggressive. Um, I got hit in the face by a baseball. No, I think it was softball. It wasn't very soft. <laughs> I remember Obviously. that. Um, the kid threw it straight up. It was Kyle. Nah, I'm not going to say any so names. His name's Kyle. Is and it Yeah. He decides to throw it straight up on a sunny day. Coming down, the sun catches my eye. <laughs> you were basically playing so ballroom, I'm right? I'm trying to play, you know, the hand as a sh like shade thing, sun blocker while catching the ball. Well, I couldn't see it, and it came down fast. It hit me in the forehead and knocked me out. And my forehead got busted open and was bleeding. Yeah, it Wasn't was kind of bloody. Although, I will say the coolest part about that was whenever I put my hand on my forehead to check if it was bleeding, I touched my hand to my forehead once, took it off, saw blood, put it back on there again. Never took it off, never moved it, kept it in that exact same spot. <laughs> Did you go now, back? When I, when I got home and looked at it, I had two dots, one dot in between them and a little bit lower, and then a straight line across my palm, and it made a bloody smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> I was creeped out about the fact that I only took my hand off my uh, forehead once, but I didn't complain because it made me laugh. Ha! Like, ah, smiley. Mm, let's see. Now, ah, remember you got time. like carpet Blood, burn or something? Please tell me you didn't time. cry. Like whenever you slid on the gym floor or something. Oh yeah, it was me and uh, Bailey and David playing. I don't know. I don't remember the name. Uh, rack. No. Uh, that one game. It's like tennis, badminton. Badminton? I thought yeah, you were hang on, hang on, hang on. No, we were getting better. No, we played a lot of things. But this is the one that got real bad. Okay. We decided we were going to do something cool. And it was me and David against Bailey and Elisa. Me and David were just dominating them. So I decided I'm going to derp around. And we hit it. Or David hit it. I slid under the net and hit it back to him. And then the really bad one was doing shh. I want to say Shukwal. I think that was it. Yeah, that was Either fun. that or Kickball. No. Kickball was never that freaking one kid Brandon like stomped my leg into the ground. I thought Petra? I broke my leg. No. Brandy. Johnson? Johnson and John Johnson and Johnson. That's terrible. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Other stories. Oh, I got another one. But yeah, this is another one of those. I was a very aggressive kid. So, my parents, you know, which I don't think they should have done. They taught me how to, like, you know, like, fight back whenever someone. I mean, they're still teaching me this after. Okay, I can already see this going wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so, my dad, you know, military guy, knows what to do. He teaching me the simple headbutt. Oh, this mm -hmm. is going to go wrong. Mm -hmm. so, he didn't tell you that it hurts you too, did it? <laughs> <laughs> apparently, apparently, this is why I couldn't remember half my childhood. 
because <laughs> this I had this next door neighbor. All right, he was a little bit of a bully, you know. And this is about three years after the preschool incident. And uh, I, I was a little calmer, you know, a little a little calmer. But I saw my anger spikes at some point, and he 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 kind of pushed me a little bit. And I was like, enough is enough. So I, he was like right in front of my face. So I tipped my head back and then boom, right boom. on his forehead or nose area. Cause he was bleeding from some point of area. And all that I came out with was just a little red spot on my forehead. And he, he was bleeding. All I had was a real, real red spot. Did I feel victorious? Yes. Absolutely. Did it feel good? No. Did it feel good on the inside of me finally getting back at this kid? Yes. Did it hurt? Still recording? Did it hurt? <laughs> Probably. Yes, I am still recording. No. Well, what are we going to do with this? Because I'm literally just standing on the bed talking. <laughs> <coughs> talking to Pip, so it's okay. They had him what? Yeah, but... Uh, Scars. Did, did Drew even like post those? Uh, Drew's still working on it. Alright, um. So he hasn't? Nope. Uh, how about creative ways to get a scar? Yeah. The, we'll call it. This is probably childhood scars. This is what we'll call scars. it. Okay. Childhood scars. Um. Brian, you got any? Because I got a lot more. Uh, I'll put at least one up. Um, sixth grade, going to my locker, average day, nothing out of the ordinary. Well, they had lockers where it was basically ones on top, ones on bottom. You remember that, Kev? I hate those lockers. I hated them too. <laughs> uh, well, I was we found bottom. Out I can fit in one. What? We found out I can fit in one. You know the top <laughs> bottom lockers? Yeah. <laughs> those things are like small. <laughs> Um, I was about to say, the regular lockers I can understand, but anyway. Think small, all right. Think yeah, small. think small. <laughs> think light. Think small. Um, and just going to my locker, well, mine's the bottom, so I have to kneel down to get to, you know, uh, put in the combination and all that, and my crap. Well, as I'm leaning down, um, I'm putting my knee down, and I just feel, uh, a little warmth in my knee, and I'm just like, huh. I guess the floors are cold, my knee's warm, whatever. So I get my stuff, I'm heading to class, I look down, I was wearing shorts, well, my knee was bleeding, and there was blood all down my leg, and I'm just kind of like, fuck. <laughs> so, I just, so me being the sixth grader I am, I go to the teacher, and I'm like, I'm bleeding. Where do I go? I don't know where I'm going to go. I go to the thing, they literally just put a band-aid on it and say, okay, back to class. Really? So yeah. That's my fun time uh, of the day. Brian! What? Go downstairs, please! Go downstairs! <laughs> please! Alright. Go downstairs! Alright, Kev, your turn. <laughs> hmm. You wanna know a mental scar? I prefer a physical one, but that'll do. <laughs> well, I'm trying to think of the physical ones. I got a bunch, but... Yeah. Do you, um, do you know I hate principles? Principles? Yeah. <laughs> Guys! <laughs> like, school principles and stuff. I hate them. Mm. There's, uh, uh, Overdale. Oh, yeah. My asthma was real bad. And I would have an attack from, like every other day. Yeah. And I'm gonna reset. There he is. Jesus! I hate this nope. guy. Well, there he is. Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Oh, fuck is he? Oh, get out of my way, guys! I'm trying to kill him. Well, help! Oh. All right. Well, my asthma would be getting real bad, and I would have to go and get my inhaler. 
Well, the principal's like, hey, you come here every day and use your inhaler. You're just faking it to get out of class. Go back to class. God damn. So I go back to class, and I'm sitting there going, <gasps> My teacher goes, are you okay? No. no. What's wrong? Well, I was able to, you know, get the signal that I couldn't use my inhaler. So the teacher's like, like, go back down there. So I'm doing as I'm told, and I go back down there. Well, the lady at the office says, look, she already got on you. Go back to class. Wow. Face is starting to slightly start to change colors. Mm. So I go back down there, and they give me my inhaler finally. Well, it doesn't really help too much, because, you know, it's pretty bad now. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's been going on for like 15 minutes at this point. Past point and over turn, jeez. So they call my mom, and she brings me the, like, the whole breathing machine, all that. Well, it doesn't really help, because it's been like 30 minutes now, because my mother had to come to school. So I go to the hospital. Mm. Well, they give me the same stuff, more medicine, some other stuff. Finally gets better. I go back to school, principal's like, why did you come back up to the office? I told you to stay into the classroom. You're not allowed to come up and get your inhaler anymore. What the fuck, man? I still had asthma attacks. <sighs> Please tell me they fired that whore. Oh, she quit the year I gradu after I graduated. After you graduated, it's the part that you took me off. <laughs> yeah, that was bullshit. Yeah. They should have had it some. They should have had a black mom there. That shit would never happen. Oh, again. that would never. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that shit would never happen again. <laughs> so yeah, I hate principals now because at uh, Zonton, similar things happen because you know I kept getting sick and hurt and stuff. Yeah. Oh, that principal hated me too. Yeah, everybody hated her right principals back. Like, ah, principles. Why? The worst part was my teachers whenever I needed glasses. I had a teacher who literally wouldn't let me do anything until I read her book whenever I needed reading glasses. I had to struggle with every word, and then he te he pre te te tested me on comprehension. I didn't even know what I read. I just made up man and words. And he... The thing I don't get though is, uh, you know, she's still the principal there at Zone. I don't know. My parents have a theory that uh, she's shagging some board of education person to keep the job or something. She probably is. That's my guess. Too. Cause you can't suck bad. that bad and still have the job. Oop. Hey, wrist sword. Well, I was giving you that, Brian. Oh. Thank you. You know what also sucks? What? Hmm? Brian, remember that Jefferson County like bonus thing you had to do where you had to get like a reference from a teacher or whatever? Oh yeah. Or a school thing. You remember how you went to the counselor? Yeah. And she gave you like that really great like reference and all that. Mm-hmm. I asked her right after you did what she wrote on my paper. Here's Brian's. Brian is an exceptional student. He excels in everything he does. He's a great like pilot. He wants to be a airline pilot thing or something like that. Blah blah oh, yeah. blah. Super special stuff. All this. Kevin Crook is an exceptional student. <laughs> He's good for your program. That was it. Gives Brian a whole page. I get three sentences. I literally looked at her and was like, are you serious? Dang. I didn't know it was only three sentences. I thought it was like half a page or three-fourths of a no. page. No. She gave me three freaking sentences. <laughs> Kevin Crook is an exceptional student. I think he would excel in your...